Hi, here's Bernardo again. There's a discussion going on about the topic we are covering today. Very frequently, press coverage and even practitioners of analytics use the terms artificial intelligence and machine learning interchangeably. And in this video, we are going to break this down for you. Are deep learning, machine learning and AI the same thing? I would really like to know what you think about it. Please put your comment below. Any device that perceives its environment and takes actions in order to maximize its possibilities of success can be said to have some kind of artificial intelligence. More specifically, we can say that AI exists when a machine has cognitive capabilities, such as problem solving and learning, for example, usually associated with a benchmark, the human level in terms of reasoning, speech, and vision. So we can say that AI has three different levels. Narrow AI is when a machine can perform a specific task much better than a human. Here is where we still are nowadays. General AI, when a machine can perform any intellectual task as a human would perform. And strong AI, when machines can beat humans in lots of tasks. One of my favorite early developments in AI is the Perceptron. It was a single layer artificial neural network designed for image recognition in the late 50s. But why are they called neural networks? Because the first practitioners of AI thought that these interconnected nodes looked like the human neural system. We humans have neural networks in our nervous system, and these are the natural neural nets, while the perceptrum is a rudimentary version of the artificial ones. As a subset of AI, we have machine learning. This is where from the 1980s, a body of research in supervised learning has flourished. This is when algorithms are trained and learned from past examples in a model that maps features to a corresponding outcome variable. Here rely most of the applications of AI for business, which we covered in one of our previous videos. So follow the link in the description if you want to know more. And finally, as a subset of machine learning, we have deep learning. It's called deep learning because it makes use of deep neural networks. While shallow neural nets have only one hidden layer between the input and the output, deep neural nets have more than one layer. This field is particularly responsible for all the advancements we had in the recent years in image recognition. Do you know that images can be represented numerically as pixel intensities in three channels, red, green, and blue? So, if you can represent an image as numerical data, you can process it with deep learning. So deep learning, machine learning, and artificial intelligence are not three different things. They are just a subsample of each other. We start with artificial intelligence, we narrow into machine learning, and then we close with deep learning. I hope that this video helps you to clarify this concept. As I said at the beginning of the video, it's a very controversial topic. So if you don't agree with these definitions or you have more doubts, please add them to the comments below.